Hello and thanks for joining us on another recipe video. On the menu today is sour yellow curry with fish. This is a very hot and sour dish that works really well with any white fish, so today we're going to be using hake. Just make sure that you use fresh fish as we'll be boiling the fish in the paste and if it's not fresh it will really spoil the taste of the dish. A lot of places will fry the fish to mask lack of freshness, but I think frying really harms the overall taste. The ingredients are on screen now. We're using a lot of chilies in this recipe as we want it to be nice and spicy. However, you may want to reduce the number of chilies depending on your tolerance for spicy food. Now, I know a lot of you will find it hard to locate a lot of these ingredients. I live in rural islands, so I can certainly relate to that. Uh, so if you go to my blog, I'll link to places on Amazon where you can buy the ingredients which we use online. The link to the blog is in the description. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is make the paste. So chop up the one clove of garlic and two shallots into fine pieces and add them to a mortar and pestle. Crush them for a few seconds before adding 10 fresh red bird eye chilies and 10 dry chilies. Then grind everything down until the chilies are smashed apart. So once your paste looks like this, add the one teaspoon of shrimp paste quarter teaspoon of turmeric and quarter teaspoon of salt and continue crushing and mixing for a couple of minutes. And after a few minutes of crushing you should end up with a paste that looks very similar to this. Next boil two and a half cups of water in a pan. We don't want to use any more than this or the curry will be too watery. Then add the paste that we made in our mortar and pestle and stir it in thoroughly allowing the curry to simmer for a couple of minutes. Then add the fish cutlets, placing them into the pan very carefully so that you don't break them apart. Let the fish cook for 5 minutes, then add the 200 grams of bamboo shoots and just stir them in very gently. Then add the one and a half tablespoons of tamarind paste and stir it into the curry until it's dissolved. Once the paste is mixed in, add the one tablespoon of fish sauce and one and a half tablespoons of sugar. Gently mix everything in and cook for a final five minutes and then you're ready to serve. We served ours with a simple egg omelette and rice which complements the recipe very well. If you like spicy and sour dishes, give this recipe a try and let us know what you think. So thank you very much for watching this video. If you like the recipe and you want to see more, do subscribe to us. We're releasing new recipes every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. And hopefully we'll see you on the next video.